separates it to one character instead of like flip-flopping between Falcon and Fox. Oh yeah, and you put need all the to work into one character so that like you just have that one strong character instead of the two cards you can exactly. play. I guess. Like you, you want to have the technicality and the swag in mm -hmm. one character. Like, it, like either way, whether it be Fox or Falcon, you can do it with both, but you just have to pick one. Oh yeah, and it's always hard to pick one because you always like like love both characters. Exactly. Looks like he's getting started here. And that was a really bad grab. That could have been disastrous for Frizz, but he barely makes it back onto the stage. Oh. He's still fighting for center stage. Yeah, that one grab actually put him into that situation. Now he's just, like, vying for that uh, center stage. Yeah, but he got that ledge hop in there, and that turned it around. Right now, Law's actually kind of chasing uh, Frizz down at the moment. Oh, and he only gets the first hit of up air. You know, traditionally, what I've heard is that uh, Fox uh, actually needs to camp against Falcon in order to, you know, utilize the uh, benefits of the matchup for Fox. Yeah. But uh, it seems like Law's just really chasing him down and, like, just using his uh, really great Fox pressure. In order to, uh, and so he did, a, he did a really nice string there. He did, like, a grounded shine, and then he jumped up the platform wavelength backwards and then fell through with the back air. That was very was, nice. Yes. And he takes the first stock. This would most li this would be an upset, like, for sure. Oh, for sure, yeah. Of course, all the Nebraska people in the com in the comments might not actually agree. To be fair, oh, he gets an up throw, uh, forward smash, people's elbow. I have a feeling that he got that from Granddaddy Dark Rain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, looks like he's about yeah. to turn this game around right there. So that's that is it right there. So brutal. Yeah, like the way that he was up airing, there's like no amount of di that Law could have done to escape that. So you know, good stuff by Frizz. Ooh, nice up the up air. Ooh, and a nice running up smash. Yeah, he got that shield poke on Frizz. Don't think he was expecting that at all. Yeah, that was very smart. Um, most people would drop through with maybe a back air, but that nair just to get the little edge to hit the shield. You see, Lost doing the same thing that he was doing with uh, AWOL. He just keeps jumping and like getting those uh, you know, last hit of up air mm -hmm. on them. So. I think he was trying to go for the ledge with that up B2, but that's really hard on Battlefield and mm -hmm. really risky. Oh, wow. They're just both fighting at the ledge right now. Oh, oh my Frizz God. going for the style. And Frizz, you need to stop SDing, man. <laughs> Like you said, Falcons is a stylish character. Yeah, exactly. This is a stylish day. Oh, gets him with the knee. Oh, but he does a nice onto attack. Uh, Law got scared for a second right there. That's why he jumped out of shield. And looks like that's be it. it. Nice back air edge guards. And he rolls up. Yeah, that's the thing about uh, Falcon. Uh, whenever it comes to edge guard, you need to have that consistency. Oh yeah, and that's what first got right there. Yeah, and it's very hard for um for Falcons to think that there's always a stylish option for your ledge guard, but sometimes you just need to roll up and take it. Or you just need to keep back airing. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's, like, no option that Law could have had. Like, you know, Frizz could have needed him backwards or something like that, you know. Mm -hmm. But, like, I'm glad that he opted for that. We're going Falco. Oh, looks like Frizz is going Falco. And he's going to counterpick him with Marth. It's Yoshi's story. That uh, is kind of crazy. Uh, he does have experience in this matchup, thanks to him playing Falco in his weakness. Okay, Frizz starts it out pretty strong. So this uh this matchup is actually considered mostly even. Yep, on this stage definitely. You know, Mars can actually get like he can make so much mileage off the platforms. He can literally do every form of his attack on those platforms, up tilt, up smash, mm -hmm. what four tilt maybe. <laughs> yeah, and then Falco's obviously he's got his lasers and his crazy shine combos. First takes it pretty fa handily first stock. He gets the grab. Can he convert? Oh. Nice combos by Law. Oh, I was expecting oh, a good jab right there. Yeah. Goes for an early forward smash. Ooh, I like that Frizz actually went onto the top platform right there. Law was expecting him. You know, I like that Law knows, that, or he's really respecting um, Frizz's shield pressure, and he's just rolling out every time. Well, that's kind of what, uh, that's like Mars' only true option yeah, uh, yeah. during uh, Shine Pressure is to roll. Like, what Mars in the shield, he doesn't really have that many options, you know? Like, yeah. his, his best option would be the fair out of shield, but, like, you know, that, that can only do Mars so much. Yeah, a lot of Mars like to um, wave dash out, though, and oh, uh, God. as you said, the fair out, it's not the safest thing, especially against a spacey. 
I like that Law didn't actually go for the force match right there. That was perfect temper. I mean, that was a perfect range for the temper, but uh, I Frizz was ready for it. He gets caught up Randall. Wow, that, that up tilt was crazy. Up oh, oh my he gets a neutral God. B to finish that off. That wow. was sickening. That was grueling. Oh, Frizz, he's going to try to shine him off the top. I was ready for an up B. Who plays Falco to kill people off the top? <laughs> oh, you didn't make Randall. Hey, by the way, don't don't answer that question because I already know that it was a student. <laughs> <laughs> I can kind of follow what you're saying, though. Not, Falco doesn't have the most vertical kill options. Wow. Frizz is doing really well with this Falco right now. Proving me wrong from before when you were asking me if he was going to go Falco. <laughs> well, he was playing Falco and PM earlier, and he was putting in some work, so I thought he might be playing Falco today. Oh, yeah, like he was playing against, what, Frail? Yeah, and uh, Shion. Oh, oh my god. Okay, somebody else was screaming about something different in another match. Oh, is that down smash going to take it? No, nope, gets the back air. Yeah, well, I'll try to get that early up E in order to catch Falco before he grabs the ledge, but he couldn't get it, so... Uh, Frizz took that, it takes that game too well. Yeah, it's been a quick game. Um, although very close. It was a 2-0, but yes, it was really close. They both played really well. You know, I, honestly, by judging judging by Law's uh, Fox, I feel like you might have been better off going with the Fox in that matchup. Mm -hmm. Although, you know, he, he might have been better off with the running gun kind of game that he was doing against AWOL, so who knows? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what you're saying. 